الرحمن الرحيم جود ايفنينج ايفري بادي اور كيس تو دي از بري تيرم 28 ويكس اكستريمي بروسيجيت 800 جرامز ار دي اس اميتد از ار دي اس سو وي اور بلان ناو تو شيفت ذيس بيشن فروم كونفينشنال ميكانيكال فينتيليشن تو هاي فريكوانسي واي وي نيد تو شيفت هيم فروم كونفينشنال ميكانيكال فينتيليشن تو هاي فريكوانسي ذيس مين وات از ذا انديكيشن اوف ذا هاي فريكوانسي ذا انديكيشن ناو بيكوز فيلير اوف كونفينشنال ميكانيكال فينتيليشن ذير از اكشولي ثري كاتيجوريز End on preterm or preterm or air leaks. Preterm, it will be RDS or uh, pulmonary dysfunction, not respond to conventional mechanical ventilation. Or full term with underlying uh, pathology like meconiums or BBHN, not responding to uh, conventional mechanical ventilation. Or there is any air leak. So why this patient is failure of conventional mechanical ventilation is on that. Clinically, patient is distressed. The technique is not. Saturation is not maintained, so this is one of the indications. The second, biochemically, the blood gas actually it showed respiratory acidosis, so we need to eliminate this CO2 because the conventional is failed to eliminate this CO2. And uh, radiologically, the X-ray show small lung volume, so we need to recruit this lung actually by high frequency, by constant and standing uh, pressure. The force mechanically, because the patient is reached to maximum, the BIB for Preterm babies, the maximum 22 to 25 centimeter water. For full term babies, it will be 25 to 28. So if you reach it to the maximum, you have actually to shift him from conventional to high frequency. Otherwise, it will hazard the baby for the risk of the viral trauma. So the high frequency, it will be this dangerous to the lung. So this is because that we need to shift this patient from conventional to high frequency. So our senior nurse, Nivea, she will show us how to shift this patient from conventional to uh, uh, high frequency. So can you can see, please. So, uh, how we will shift the babies from their conversion to high frequency. So this, was, uh, this one is the conventional mode. From here, we just uh, stand by here. Then, this already the parameters is already set in the bus because the baby is previous in the conventional mode. So we just, uh, the baby is newborn already set here. So we just press the ventilation settings. Here we can uh, see the parameters and here also there is a high frequency. So we just press here. So here there is the settings, the high frequency settings is here. With the FIO2 frequency, amplitude and map. The map, map here is... Um, 11. 11. Why you choose 11? So, because uh, the airway pressure here is 8. So, I have, so I have to add 2. So, we added here the 2. Just press here the button. Then the amplitude here is 20. Because here the, um, the map is uh, double. We can, uh, if the map is 10, so we can uh, choose the double one. The amplitude is 20. And the frequency we are um, calculating by the weight of the baby. So just press the high frequency, then already set it, and the, this one is on high frequency ventilation. Now the high frequency starts it, and they are choosing the parameter. So just a minute, I will show the screen. This one is the high frequency ventilator, and here the FIO2 is 30 percent frequency is 10. Map is 10 and the amplitude is 20. So the double here. From the map to amplitude is 20. Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you, doctor.